today's video we're gonna be replacing this oil pan gasket because this truck is leaking pretty bad you can see it's just leaking profusely out here all over the bottom of the pan first thing we're gonna do is take off the oil We're going to take off these support bars, 13 millimeter. Now we're going to take off this crossbar. It's 18 millimeters. Two bolts, one in here, one over here, 13 millimeters. All right, now that you got that crossbar up, now you have access for the pan to come out. Now we're going to take up the flywheel axis panel bolt, 10 millimeter. We're going to knock out that bolt right there that holds the harness across the front. Once you take off the bolt on the driver's side, you just go ahead and pull it out of its nub right there, and it comes off the oil pan. Alright, so now we're going to go ahead and start taking off all the mount bolts. up in the front using the new gasket for reference you can count that there's 15 bolts that are going to be holding this in Fifty millimeter for the bell housing to the oil pan. Now we're gonna take off the fifteen sixteen nut for the steering rack. And here you go. Now we go ahead and clean up the ceiling surface, get all residual oil and dirt off, and then get the new one ready. And we're gonna go ahead and install it. And the same thing for the actual engine block. We're gonna go ahead and clean off all the mating surfaces and all debris and get it prepped for the new oil pan gasket.
Since it's an M8 bolt, the torque is 18 foot pounds. These bolts are 35 foot pounds. Online, I found that it was 70 foot pounds for this torque. Okay, now you just go over every bolt that you touched, make sure it's all tight, make sure all the mount bolts for the oil pan is all tight and torqued since that's what's gonna be sealing uh, and preventing an oil leak. And just go everything and make sure everything's all back to where it is. And now you can go ahead and change the filter if you're doing an oil change, if you time this perfectly, and or, I mean, if you're gonna put new oil, you wanna put a new filter in there also. And there you go. Now you replace your oil pan gasket on your uh, Chevy Silverado. Hopefully this video helps y'all. Y'all have a good one.